When you're making a multi-layered design, you may need to resize the content of a layer, as opposed to resizing the entire image. To do that, you'll use a transform command. If you're following along, you can use this image from the practice files for this tutorial, or you can use your own multi-layered image. Let's say that we want to make this photo of sewing tools smaller. The first step is to go to the Layers panel and select the layer that contains that photo, which is the Tools Photo layer. I'll click on that layer to select it. Then go up to the Edit menu and choose Free Transform. That puts this border around all the contents of the selected layer, so if there were more artwork on the same layer, all of it would be encompassed within that border and all would be resized together. Now usually you don't want to distort an image as you resize it. To avoid that, hold down the Shift key to constrain proportions as you click on any edge or any corner and drag in to make this photo smaller or out to make it larger. By the way, it's fine to make layer content smaller, but in most cases it's best not to make pixel-based content, like a photograph, a lot bigger than the original, or it may look blurry. The last step is to accept the change that you made with the transform command. One way to do that is to go up to the options bar and click the big check mark that appears there whenever you use free transform. And that's all there is to it. Another thing you can do is to resize the content of more than one layer at a time. This can save you time and can help you to resize multiple images by the same amount. So let's say that we want to make both the sewing tools photo and the photo of the tailor smaller at the same time. They're located on two different layers, so we have to go over to the layers panel and make sure both of those layers are selected. The tools photo layer is already selected. If yours isn't, just click on that layer. To add the Taylor Photo layer to the selection, hold down the Command key on the Mac or the Control key on Windows and click on the Taylor Photo layer. Then, as before, go up to the Edit menu and choose Free Transform. Hold down the Shift key and click on any edge or any corner of the border that surrounds both of the images on both selected layers. Drag inward to make both photos smaller at the same time. And when you're done, go up to the Options bar and click the big check mark to accept that change. So that's how to resize layers with Free Transform. Please don't confuse this technique with resizing an entire image, which is done with the Image Size command in the Image menu, as you learned in another tutorial in this series.